this is the shirt that I was wearing still wearing so I was celebrating 4th of July I went out to go meet up with some friends I understand all the talk all the theories about the 4th of July and I've heard all the rumors all the it's one of the biggest lies ever told I, I understand that I was out I had stopped to text a friend find out where they were at and right before I sent that text message I was gonna send it another text message I, I told my friend I said I have a bad feeling that something's gonna go wrong I just have this gut feeling and as soon as I sent that text message this boom I was shocked I was angry I still had my phone in my hand I mean that that of itself is a miracle and I jumped up I said who did this who did this where are because I didn't even see him they came at me from behind there was a white guy a couple white women that came running over to help me get up they they kept saying hey I got it on video I just happened to be recording when when the guy did it I've got his face let's go to the cops so this is a situation whoever did this they put me in a situation where I have to snitch. You're gonna hit me when I'm not looking. I'm minding my own business. I'm not bothering anybody. I'm just minding my own business. And when we were over at the police, I heard that other white guy who was wearing an American flag shirt, not exactly like mine. He said, but the guy hit me too. He hit me right here. He hit me when I wasn't looking. So they're taking pictures of me. They give me, you know, case number, all that kind of stuff. I heard the cops saying, okay, they got him. They got him. It is because that guy that was recording the video happened to record his face. While he's in handcuffs, he says, I don't like the American flag. I have issues with that. And so I'm thinking to myself, oh, so basically this is a hate crime. So what I have to tell y'all, some people are really violent towards patriots the person that hit me was a black man that hit me for wearing this flag don't you know that black people fought in the american revolution don't you know that black people served in the u.s military this is where we're at in american history not only is our freedom at stake not only are we not free to to have freedom of expression I really think that this hates Donald Trump and I really feel like we're at that time in our history where our freedom is being taken away. We don't, we're not free to express ourselves. We're not free to vote for whoever we want to vote for. Some people believe in the American flag. Some people believe in patriotism, but some people don't. And some people are willing to resort to violence to prove how much that they don't like patriotism and the American flag and liberty. Some people don't believe in freedom and liberty and justice for all. So you have to be careful. Our freedom is at stake. Our freedom is being taken away. We don't have the freedom that we used to have anymore.